professional background. <laughs> Which way are you going? East. Well, you can't go down Wilson. That's what I was thinking because it's between uh, Fairfax uh, and what? Between Fairfax and La Brea, it's shut, right? Okay. Uh, Beverly, I guess. Uh, no, you're farther than that. You're like down to Highland. Okay. Well, oh, might as well just stick on the boulevard then. Okay. Wow. How scenic. That or hop on the freeway. I will leave that to our driver. We're right over the skateboarder. Uh, try to keep the death, death toll on this thing to zero. No, 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 I could think of but one. You. I know. Participant. That guy was more worried about a cigarette in his mouth than the door opening in front of the mouth. <laughs> Don't juggle, I don't want
we got to go that far, you might as well pick the Illinois. <laughs> That's like VA bus or something. Yeah, like that. yeah. I've, I think I may have seen it a long time ago. Where I've. It's like, a lot of the uh, military police parties around. Yeah, well, they're very tight about uh, yeah. you being well, in. I, I, I saw that. I can see that sign when you get your name on the 788. Yeah. Yeah, they're none too friendly. <laughs> have they ever been friendly? Uh -huh. <laughs> so restricted you can't really be taking pictures on their property they're right, very that's right. that's very right. well good go for it hey. that shit looks like he belongs there so yeah thank you you're welcome I 
Come down the wrong way and make a left into here. You see him? Kind of made a U turn. Out, out, out one driveway and another. Probably something over there. that track been left would have been a nice little branch line for Expo to come up yeah. here. You know some parts of Expo they actually do get railroad tracks still embedded in the street. Yes. Gee the guys think of, oh jeez, at least I don't have the oldest bus out here. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We had to get an old RTD one. <laughs> they most of, by the time they were sold, they were trash, and the yeah. stuff that would show up in you know by the side of the road or yards, the stuff yeah. was really the frames were just trash. I mean. They went through that midlife process, and took all the I mean, these seem to have had a little bit more of a cushy lifestyle. Yeah. No, these I were basically used like a commuter bus type of thing. Yeah. They didn't get the, you know. They were abused. They didn't get the 18 to 20 hour work days. Yeah. You know, buses here did, I mean. I mean, we've seen candidates in the past that are now gone, but just the amount of money it would have taken. Yeah. How much? Who knows? Because it would have been, you're blindly just picking something out of the desert and saying, okay, let's make it run. Yeah. There's a couple of 7100s out of Kramer I was thinking about. No, 5742 was Primo's. Huh? 5742 was like, that was kind of to me the most likely. Yeah, I don't know. Or the last diesel was before they went over to huh? CNG, where the last diesel was. Kind of in a true sense, that was 1502 was the last one. Not even. No. 
3,000. Yeah, the 3,000s came later, but they were the last new diesels bought. Then there were also the 9140s, which were secondhand from Orange County. Call the Ryan's, uh, well, buses, they, they technically are MTA buses. So that's why I right there. Yep. Even though they technically don't, <laughs> they, they don't exist in the minds of some people. <laughs> and that's your right quite good, though. For what they are, they're still on the road. It's amazing. Well, the angel's going to ask long time. Yeah, but Ar yeah, Orion products like. are not known for their longevity. Or were the best ones? Yeah, I mean, it really depends on what area you're talking about. I mean, really, I mean, you know, the GM products are always going to be pretty much held pretty high. Flex World fairly good as a close second. Just by any, if you ask the experts, as they said. But I mean, it's like look at this bus; it's still running and flawless. That's one thing about it. Just it just depends on how it's kept, really. It, it doesn't. It doesn't really rattle. No, it does it, good. Uh, the doesn't. Frame, the frame feels like it's pretty sturdy. It doesn't wobble or shimmy or nothing. And you know, I, the thing about Sacramento is they they optioned everything out. I mean, it's got an air dryer, it's got power steering, it's supposed to have air conditioning, but, you know. I was going to say, I guess, I guess you have to go to the bus line, huh? <laughs> I got pushed enough buttons today. What do you mean? This bus line right here. What bus line? The bus oh, line right oh, well, when they shredded up the street with the right of way and did the, this yeah, of it. ten years ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, ten. Yeah. Is the X sign still here? The <laughs> what? There was a, there was a sign for. Uh, Sound horn. For them to, uh, you know, whistle for the crossing. It was here for the long There's time. a really good movie that was shot in the parking structure in there called uh, The Outside Man with Roy Scheider. It was a French production, but it was shot here in English. And it's just full of RTD buses and stuff. But there's a big shootout there, and you see buses going by and stuff. Really well done movie. Very uh, hard to find. It only came out on DVD a couple of years ago. Yeah, what was? Yeah. yeah. Okay, go down real short. Yeah. What was really cool? We were coming through here. Me and Phil. We were in service in a Neil plant, and at that bus stop, and there was they were doing something. There was another fence that was up here and still had Southern Pacific Transportation property, no trespassing, all that. And they were just cutting down the fence, they were going to cut the signs up. So I said, hey, mind if we get this? Oh yeah, sure. Click, 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 click. Here you go. I remember I carried it home on the bus. That was fun. Those were just fun times. Yeah. I guess it's too early for Santa Claus. <laughs> <laughs> I or, say. or Nick Nolte walking around. <laughs> I was gonna say, if you want to see a little bit of a uh, Southern Pacific history rotting away, they got they got an old baggage car in a diner rotting away off the Burbank Junction over there. Mm -hmm. Burbank. Yeah, they got an old they got they got an economy baggage and a diner sitting on that spur. Oh, okay. Well, somebody is. Yeah, those are just thrashed. Those are the same ones that have been sitting there for a long time. Yeah, they're beat and thrashed. Yeah. You beat for a while, had them at the west end of Jemco for a while, and then moved them someplace else. We just had to park them there. 
are they like maintenance of way or are they actually like a privately owned thing or what? Who knows what you guys are doing with them, but the cars are almost pretty much like they're being slowly stripped away. How come this thing looks like it's almost like a track gauge right here? That's what it is. Looks like it, but it isn't. Back, I think it might be. Nope. No, I guess not. Just, no, that was a pipeline. The, the train was over there. Yeah. yeah I remember when they built all this crap in 85. Yeah, I remember when there was train tracks still there. Yeah. yeah. I remember seeing some of the last few. Oh, yeah. Every now and then, like, on the one that says, like, it's plastic Hollywood, LA stuff. Late paper one of those, they actually, they're around them, uh, I guess, filter some of the old pictures around. I think that one might be yours, John. I wanted one of those things. Might be. Yeah, or photos that are all that. So there's some shots I found somewhere, and it was like, basically at the end, as P had, there was like this weird track gate thing. I think it was like right about here. And over at the Cannon layover, you can see a 3100 sitting there. There's the rest of the PD railway. I'm surprised they didn't fit the sidewalk here. There had been stuff there. They just did what they did. There's a good bus on the four of them. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh.
Sam, what year were you born? 86. Where the heck have you been? <laughs> you just woke up. I was in the, the duck pond somewhere. I was in the third grade in 86. 86. 86. Watching the last uh, trains on the air. Well, I was in the sixth grade. What was the airline? 86. I was working at Point Center in Oh, no, really? I remember about 86. That's when Haney's kind of like last visited. But nobody could see it. Yep. Yeah. Especially. I guess, I guess you were saying what, what that one that I used to see at Vernon Yard was a hail bottle. Oh, wow. <laughs> 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 <Bloody. laughs> hey, look, a bus is coming. Oh, damn, it's not mine. Oh, damn. You should put the bottom up there, Sean. <laughs> wow. Too late now. My hands are cold. Heritage Club. Oh, oh, let's go buy a golf car. Club. Like this. Like, Honey. Yeah. Let's, what? Let's do like this. He's like, and then he jumped in the, oh, look at this. That T-Bird shirt looks cute. <laughs> Which one? Getting a little too deep into character oh, there. Go, go, go a little further. You'll see what he's talking about. <laughs> They're matching Burberry. Meanwhile, walking the dog. That's exactly, yes. Exactly yeah, we're waiting to get a table with pump. Oh, yes. Pull this in Valley Park and see what they say. Oh, ten bucks. There's valet parking behind. The deal. <laughs> the bus, the bus. 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 is right over there. Oh, Yielding at crosswalk. Right color. Mm -hmm. Do you 